Hello and welcome back to the Hugh Lane. So today we're going to be making surprise springtime flower cards. And so what you will need is three pieces of A4 card, a pencil, some markers, a black sharpie, double-sided sellotape, sheets of clear plastic, scissors and a ruler. So first we need to fold the page over, leaving a slight border on the side. And next we will just fold over the border back onto the page. So next we measure our frame, so we're going to do 1.5 centimetres all the way around. And then we cut out the middle. So now we measure inside our frame so we know how wide it is. And once we know how wide it is, we can cut out two pieces of paper so that they will fit inside. And now we're going to attach the first piece of paper into the frame by using double-sided sticky tape. So as you can see, it's just the bottom of the page that is attached. Um, so here I've included some drawings of some spring flowers, but I'm sure you can come up with much better ones. So I started by just doing a pencil sketch of how I wanted to lay out my flowers on the page. Once I was happy with them, I then added some colour. And once I coloured it in, I realised there were some spaces, so I just added a few more flowers. So next we're going to cover the piece of paper with a piece of plastic exactly the same size. So now we need a piece of card to attach those two pieces together. So if you measure it and then fold it in half. Then put double sided sticky tape on your card. Put your drawing on the bottom piece, then add your piece of plastic and fold it over from the top. So we're nearly there now. So we're going to draw with the black sharpie onto the plastic page. So now we're going to slot the drawing into the frame, but first we're going to take away about a centimetre from the bottom of the drawing. And then we're going to put the black sheet over the page inside and the drawing behind it. And then we just glue down the side of the frame with another bit of double-sided sticky tape. And the final thing to do is add your title. So if you measure your piece of paper into the corner, then you can draw the shape you want, cut it out, and then decorate it as you would like. And finally, stick your title on, and it is all finished. Just remember not to pull out the card too far. So I hope you've enjoyed making your spring cards today. Please do share them with us on social media as we would all really love to see them. And we're really looking forward to seeing you back in the gallery when we open very soon.